play on the tang and enjoy the show. We're doing an impromptu Matt cast. It's Matt Man and Iron Kelly. And well, I only have a couple minutes. <laughs> I don't know. It's a quick it's a quick one. But it's this AR AI art that you're doing. And I'm what we were on this uh brain ice cream uh van here. So if you look, it, it says brainstorm, take me away from the norm. I was actually listening to 311 and I was just typing it like in this thing. If you look, uh, the one above it has four pictures above that. Um, mm -hmm. and so then, it's in that. I upscaled that one. So it, yeah, every time yeah. you do one of these, these, um, these arts, it comes up with four separate pictures of what you're typing in. So basically I type in what I want it to say. Or what I want the I describe the picture, however, and then it it takes millions of Google pictures and, and, and searches and makes a picture out of it. So I I was listening to Three Eleven's um, Amber, mm -hmm. and I was like, and I was like, all right, brainstorm, take me away from the norm, and I typed that in, and that's. What it's is. like a tank. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> you see the other pictures like the same thing, and then I typed in. Then I took that picture, mm -hmm. the next picture down, you can see I took that picture. Um, you can see the HTTP, so I put it into a, a web, copy the web uh, site. And then it says, I've got to tell you something because the song is brainstorm, take me away from the norm. And it goes, I've got to tell you something. And then that's when that came up. It looks like Steve Carell on the bottom left. I don't know if you see that picture. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I like, I think the one on the bottom right is pretty cool. Um, oh, yeah. And then the one right under this, whoa, Amber is a color energy. That one came up really good. Yeah, I love that. So that was, so the so I used that one. Then I did a different um, scale to where my my background is on my monitor, twenty one to nine, and did it again using that picture. I just redid it, like I made a variation, and that's why the uh, and then I used those as my backs, my actually my uh, my background on my computer for a while. Yeah, this is yeah. I'm right in there with the amber and all that. This is really good with the variations off of that as well. And then it goes down into the <clears throat> battle stance, concept art, and the No Man's Sky stuff, which is all awesome. Especially uh, the No Man's Sky Infinite Universe with the insane detail in each of the pictures. Just really, just mind-bogglingly good. Yeah. The bun on the bottom right in the four, that almost looks like the egg from um, Zelda. Which one? Uh, uh, Link's Awakening. No, oh, are you talking about on the at Galaxy's the Infinite Universe? Yeah, one? the one in the bottom right. There's like an egg shape right by like the line of boats. It's like a cloud or like a mountain, but it, it reminds me of that like egg that was at the top of the mountain in Link's Awakening. Oh. But the like porcupine slash weird vegetation here on the upper left is actually pretty cool. The one in the upper left is really cool. I actually upscaled that one underneath of it, and it gets more, even more detail to it. So it looks like there's actually rooms inside with like a library, and that's actually my background right now. Awesome, insane. And then, I don't know, I, I'll post some of the ones real quick that I actually saved that I like that I've done over like the past year that I've used as backgrounds or that I really like. I like, here's a really funny good one. Uh, copy. This was, now I'm just going to paste it on the bottom. This was, the prompt was a zombified Christopher Walken. Wow. <laughs> That's awesome. And then this one was a good one. This was a, a dapper zombie. All right, that is pretty dapper, almost kind of steampunk <laughs> looking. But as far as zombies goes, I've I've seen worse dressed. Um, Chris was with me when I did this one. This is a this is like a chess piece battle. Ooh, the fucking detail in that. Um, and then one that I really liked was, this was like not what I was going for at all, but it just looked cool. So I saved it. This has a lot of detail in it too. 
Oh, wow. The, with almost like the Uchiha eye. Yeah. Now, now, this next one, I actually was going for something like this, but I didn't know what was going to happen. I typed in, like, cyberpunk, purple and red neon colors, sky bar, you know, cyberpunk style. And, and this came up, and I was like, dude, I would go visit there in a minute. I wish that we oh, had, like... Yeah. That looks it right. looks straight it looks straight out of like mm -hmm. like um uh, like Blade Runner. Yeah. Like the concept art for a scene of a bar they're going to. Yep. That looks great. All the Lastly, detail. This one was cool. This one was uh, my background for a while. It was uh I think I did like Heaven versus Earth, uh Fire versus Lightning, Demons versus Angels, and this is what came up. Wow. Look at that. That is. It's fun. Every time, I'm like, like if I'm like just chilling at my computer, it's kind of just what I, uh, I get on and I'll just do this. Wow. Just mess around. This is awesome because it's very artistic and very like, God, that AI is so, it's so impressive with the angels versus lightning. Oh man. And then that is crazy. Yeah, it's 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 cool because like and I feel bad. I'm not the one actually doing the art, but I'm explaining what I want it to be. Yeah. And then I could and then I could take that and change it and do whatever I want with it. And yeah. Oh wait, I did I did do a projangers right there. So <laughs> you can see right above the Christopher Walken. I I typed in projangers. Now the letters are yeah. never going to be the same. I saw that and I was like, well, all right, what? the hell is going on here right? i don't like the top one where it says rapies yeah i was like <laughs> i don't i don't think i like that being associated but what the hell AI? I, that is not right at all but then you you know you show what it can actually do with the the stuff below here which is amazing um especially the hotel um so i just um i'm redoing it so i just said to to redo it, um, yeah, the, 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 it'll come up with something different, and I can also take this. <laughs> the rapies was a bit much. You, I think you did it once before, and I it was did. in um like um. Uh... Here, I have it right here. Copy. It was in like the album art, yeah, or yeah, like a radio station for Jangers. That one in the bottom right, how it got the name right was cool. <laughs> I mean, if you look at the one above it, her jangers. This is just, <laughs> yeah, yeah. And I'm like, uh, this is like you could put these signs if you're doing like a like a futuristic alien, um, like anything. Like you could have that as like a backdrop. As like, oh, that's a projanger sign on like Klingon or something. And oh yeah, that's the Vulcan sign. What were they doing here? Eh, it's a different market. But yeah, this one okay. There's no rapies, so that's better. And one says Rardis. <laughs> Rardis. <laughs> that, that that that's better. It's not rapies. That's better. It's better. So Almost I like a Hawaiian. It. So I just did a new one that says logo style symmetrical instead of hyper realistic and bright colors. I took those out. So this, and I'll probably do again a new concept. Maybe, uh, take out super detail and do logo style 60. So, that's And I pay you a certain, I pay for this month. I mean, you get a certain amount for free. I think you get like 30 for free. But yeah. I pay 30 bucks, 30 bucks a month to get as many as I want to do. Well, it's not bad when you actually put out the stuff that you do. Like, this stuff is impressive. Now, you should see. So, like, I'm going to go to the other thing here and give, show you some of the stuff that people make in this. Like, let me grab one here. Um, we'll do characters. Copy image. 
The last one, I like the bottom left one because it almost looks like you're trying to say wall jangers in German. Like, here's the one that somebody did. Damn. Yeah, I'm not there yet. And some of the some of these people have stories. Like, they use that and they'll variant that and tweak one word to make it a story. It's pretty cool the way that some of these people do this. Because um, I'm in their uh, the mid journey, like, uh, Discord. It's all Discord based. Mm hmm. Like, I do it right in Discord. That's awesome that there's this avenue out there for, like, if you can learn the uh, way of c getting it to construct what you want, then there's a whole community of people who can put out amazing artwork, like uh, this yeah. last one you showed. That's almost like, it gives me, like, Street Fighter, Tekken vibes, you know? Almost like Baki at an at Netflix uh, anime. Like a fighting anime show, it gives like, and of course, you have to have a cat in the universe. If you have a whale, you got to have a space cat. Like you never know really what it's going to build. That's part of the interesting like surprise to it. You know the uh, suspense, the anticipation of what you're actually going to get when you actually type in one thing alone. Oh, yeah. Because I, I mean, tried it once or twice, and I was like, that didn't give me anything. And then, uh, you know. And there's, you can it. do pixel art. You can do video game art, concept art. There's different, whatever I type in. Like, this dude, the Destiny 2 picture looks badass. Um, let me see here. Oh, that's pretty cool. City of Lantis, underwater, photorealistic, cinematic, beautiful lights, AR3, AR, just aspect ratio, 3-2. Copy. So these are the four that I came up. That was pretty cool. Oh wow! Like scenery. Yeah. Like I could do one like kind of like that. So I would do almost like the underwater, uh, the water temple in Ocarina of Time. Yeah, underwater level. I just bought Ocarina. O C A R I N A. Yeah. In cyberpunk style. That'd be fucking okay. awesome. Beautiful scenery, underwater level. Ocarina time, underwater level. Hyper realistic cyberpunk style, neon. We do aspect ratio two to one. So I don't know if you can see it right now if it says mid journey bot or anything, or if that's just me. Yeah, it does mid journey. So it usually takes a minute, and then I'm going to start. So right now it's starting. It may or may not look good. I might need to tweak some things, do, like, lighting from top, you know. I'm really curious how this is going to show up. <laughs> you can just see it rendering. Yeah. Uh, I kind of actually, I, I like the... I like the one in the top with the fish in the it's box. Up. In the box? Yeah. That one's cool. The one in the box. The one with the... I'm not going to do the Triforce shapes because of legal reasons, but this is as close as you're going to get in the center of the fish is really cool. <laughs> it, it will It will do... Like I've done... I've tried to do Triforce before. Um, um, the fish that has oddly shaped... Uh, like bowl in the bottom right with the almost like looking like a car that's like that's cool this, cause there's this like this is pretty cool I'll show you this oh, it. the turtle one, seems like he's a little bit disgruntled I mean he doesn't have a head so I can't tell <laughs> so I did this one and I called it let's see I did this one and it was Zelda Triforce 100 meaning like I want 100% of this to look 
more like Zelda. Super resolution, focused, very detailed. Mm-hmm. And this is what came up. And then I scale. I, I took one to upscale just one of them, but I don't like the like I like those pictures better than the one that came out, but it still looks good. Uh, copy paste. That's the one I liked. Uh, I did it. Yeah. The one, the one before that. So it doesn't just put in the Triforce. Like it puts in pictures like it. Mm-hmm. I like, I mean, the one, the two top ones and the one above the fish that you just shared, it almost looks like a Jedi holocron. Yeah, this one came out really good, too. That wasn't a Zelda one, but it was just... Ooh, I like that. So here's the fish one. Almost like runes on the side of it. Nice little detail. So now what I can do is I can actually make variations of that one picture. So I'm doing a variation of the fish one. With more ruins. More ruins? Yeah, okay. the background. So what I can do then is I can get this picture, open it in browser, copy the browser picture. And then I'll do this. I like how it's different. Fish. water. Ruins. So I took that one picture, and that's what the HTTP is. Yeah. And then I just did underwater ruins. I don't know if it's what ruins, but yeah. So it looks like the when I tried to make variations, it did like the similar thing, but the TV is different. Whatever this box it's in, the TV is different. Yeah. Also, want to take this picture. I'll take one of these pictures up. The I have time to take one of these pictures upscale, and then I'm going to do downlighting. Oh wow! I kind of like the top right one. Or actually, I like. I don't know. I kind of like the top two. Bottom left one looks good too, though. The bottom, yeah, the bottom left one. I like that cage, but the. The scenery in the top, top two right. are, are the top right is kind of my favorite because it's very right, taking that one up vast. scale two. So what I'm doing is I'm taking two and up scale and just that one picture. And then what I'm going to do is do not the band. Okay, that doesn't mean the band. Okay. You too. All right. I hope you can't hear my SpongeBob going on in the background. So, this is what mid-journey is. And, like, you can see why you get lost. Like, why... 30, oh, yeah. 30 pictures is not enough, because it's just, like, you get really into it and get, like, go down a... Almost like how you would do, like, YouTube rabbit holes. Yeah. You do the same in this. Like, you find something you really like, and like, oh, my God, I gotta do something like that. Or then you'll think of something, like... I think when I went around, around the room with it, I was, like, I had tools on my desk, I had, like, a pencil, I had, like, Cough drops. I was like, because what you do is you type in backslash imagine. I don't know if you can do it or not. In your messages, if you type in backslash imagine space, are you not? Would anything happen? Does it like prompt you? Yeah, prompt. It did do it? Yeah. So now just start typing whatever you want, followed by a comma, whatever you want, followed by a comma, and you can make one of your own. I think. So I'm going to take this picture now. Open the browser. Copy it. Down here. Back to here. And I'm going to do... Backslash. Imagine. Space. Put that in. Comma. Downlighting. Surround. So... Around, so Surrounded by ruins. Ruins. And then I'm going to say mm. 
X A R. <laughs> Not accepted. <laughs> well, oh, you can't do anything that's like naughty. Oh, it wasn't even naughty. I was making a superhero. What didn't I? <laughs> Oh, what, and let you do it? Nah, I gotta be part of it. Okay, that's why. Two on, so. This one. That one in the top uh, top left is awesome. The the bottom left is dope as shit too. <laughs> oh wow, they're all awesome. Batman video game style wearing a fedora fight scene in a ruined city. The bottom right that just capsulates like a fucking action scene. That is actually That's... really fucking dope. I love yeah, all of those. <laughs> I love all of those. Get you addicted real fast. Those are so fucking great. It's all done in there's there's a this was like the original one. Now there's a few other ones that are just as good. There's ones you can do like actual moving things. I've got, but I like this one because I already kind of gotten a lot of it down. Oh my god, that one in the top left would be awesome with like the fire moving in the background. Mm -hmm. Any of them would be looked dope with the well, fire. Well, you movie. can do that. You can go to the U1 was upscale one. So the uh -huh. pictures is one, one is top left, two is top right, three is bottom left, four is bottom right. So you can do U1, which is upscale one. V is variant. So you can vary from one. But I would just do U1, and then you open it in a web page. Copy the web page browser. Paste that under the imagine. Paste that comma. And then you can add things to it. So... So this is slowly becoming pretty awesome now. Um, I really like, I think I'm going to stick with the bottom or top. I think I'm going to go with the uh, upscale two. This is crazy. It really is, isn't it? This is so crazy. I can see exactly why people get addicted to this. This is awesome. One day I did this, I was like going to play a game, and I was like, ah, I haven't played playing yet. And I, then I sat here and I did this for like three hours. I'm just, oh, like, I just getting like different ideas that. out of my head. But you can see like where this has come oh, so yeah, far, right? So awesome. Where this beautiful scenery, Ocarina of Time, underwater level has gone from the one with the fish looking at it's like in the TV and underwater, which I kind of like the most so far, to this underwater ruin. Oh yeah, yeah. I all these it's pictures good, are great too. Different. But the the one in the cent uh, on the top uh the top right looks like it's part of the like the architecture of the game and everything. It looks really good. Ah oh, shit, son. Look at that Matt man. Stressed from the world, but still <laughs> dapper as shit. Wearing a fedora. Now look, now I'll take this, open it in the browser, I'll copy you the browser. Copy the, the, the website. I'll go back to Discord and I'll type in. This. Fire in background. Let's change the aspect ratio to two. They are two to one. I'm in relaxed mode too. I'm actually going to switch settings, fast mode because. Fast mode goes faster, but it just, uh, I'm a certain amount. But that's fine. I have plenty. Oh, wow. That underwater scene is dope, especially. Yeah, I'm going to take that now, and I'm actually going to see if I can copy both my pictures together. So I'm going to take that. 
Imagine that one. Now I'm going to go back up here and take this picture. The original picture. Here, open browser. Copy that one. Oops, wrong button. Go to this. Open a browser. Go to this. Copy that. Go back to Discord. That. Look what I did to your picture. <laughs> Hold on. Do you see what I did to your picture? Uh, the one above the the fish. It's yeah, fire I took your background. picture. And I, uh, the wait, fire wait, wait. in background is is crazy. I, it's too like, much. <laughs> the one in the bottom right is definitely too much because that guy has a weird looking face. The other one on the top left, he just has like this weird ass nose, but there is like a weird looking person or trash can there it's very interesting the top the top right one is not bad but i think my favorite is the bottom left because that guy had a bad day but you can't tell from his face so i'll show you one that's similar that i did um this, these two are pretty cool these are two that i did this was like Call of Duty. I think I did Tarkov character decked out, walking away silhouette, you know, burning city in the background. That one's dope. Wow. All the fucking smoke and just the buildings. It almost looks like it could be a cover to a, a fucking comic. Oh, Frank, we're coming for your job. Hey, I'm coming for your job. Hey, man, give that this in quantum computing. We're not going to even know what is real on TV. With this dose of hope from the Matt Man. Obviously, if you, you can see from this these images, uh, the day that I'm having with fire and brimstone. <laughs> uh, the Call of Duty style images are dope. I like those too. So this is done. So now what I want to do is take this. Open it. This is my last one. Then I gotta go. This. This. So I forgot to do a magic. It's like a fish tank within a within <laughs> a washing machine fish tank. It's really dope. Though. I still like the original. Kind one. Kind of like uh, gives me um, um, Bioshock vibes. Yeah. Uh, look at that sexy individual right there. Batmobile trashed in the background. But it's that's comics. That looks like comic style, doesn't it? Yeah, that's what I, I love that one. Let's see. Hold on. Let's see if I can do this. Oh, this. Put the browser. Copy that. See, I have to go, but I'm like addicted. All right, now this is just getting fucking weird. <laughs> what? So if you upscale one of those, it'll be in the sixteen nine. All right, I gotta go. All right, buddy.
Talk to you later. Yep. See you tomorrow. Bye. P-J-A-N-D-W-H dot com.